When? Okay, well, okay I'm, I'm not supposed to be reading this. And Ruth will critique me after. I am finished. Because she is a master professional natural public speaker. But I'm sure if I try to remember my thoughts in putting this together, I would have left out something really important. So style will have to take a back seat to form and substance, and I hope you will indulge me for a little while as I read through this. Yay. We sure will, Lenny. Just getting warmed up. <laughs> on, by, on behalf of myself and Ruth, Eileen and Larry. Yay. Yay. Woo, woo. Vicki and Ellis. Yay. And the grandparents who are not with us, but are here in spirit through us, my parents, Sarah and Irving, Eileen's father, Louis, Vicky's parents, George and Audrey, Ellis's parents, Isaac and Nancy, and one grandparent who is here with us and has established a special bond with Raquel, Carol. Carol, where are you? Carol! We all want to welcome you and thank you for coming to share this special occasion with Raquel and Joel. We hope for all of you will be a joy and a wonderful memory. Some of you have traveled long distances to be with us. And for those, we have special appreciation for your endeavor and efforts. We have guests from New Jersey and Massachusetts, from Washington, D.C. and Baltimore and Florida, from the West Coast, California, and Seattle. <laughs> yes. And we have a good representation from Canada, from Toronto, of course, and Vancouver. Yay! <laughs> and we have the United Kingdom represented. Yay! And we have Andrew all the way from Israel. Have I missed any other countries of far cities? Long <laughs> Island is not exactly a Texas, I, okay. <laughs> yes, sorry, Connecticut. Although Joel and Raquel live just down the road from here, on the Upper West Side of Manhattan, it has been and will continue to be quite a journey for them as well. Joel is originally from Vancouver, and then raised in Toronto. He got his undergraduate degree from McGill University. He received his law degree from New England School of Law, making law review and dean's list. Yay. <laughs> Woo -hoo. At the cap off his legal education, he received the Masters of Law in Intellectual Property from the University of British Columbia. Wow. I didn't tell you. He currently practices commercial law in Manhattan with a specialty in intellectual property. If anyone needs an intellectual property attorney, of course. <laughs> Raquel is originally from Queens, and then Great Neck on Woo! Long Island. <laughs> she was a superior student, an excellent writer, and a pretty good ballet dancer, if I do so, say so myself. <laughs> she went to SUNY in Buffalo, and then transferred to Barnard in New York City where she completed her undergraduate degree and was president of the senior class. Woo! Woo! I still remember being overwhelmed by her graduation speech to her class. She's a much better speaker than I am. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I just said it. <laughs> she took about a year off to do medical research here in New York City at Columbia Presbyterian, and then she went on to medical school and earned her MD at the Albany Medical College. She continued her, we have some Albany Medical College people. She continued her medical education with an internship and residency at Children's National uh, Medical Center in Washington, D.C. She is now in private practice as a pediatrician in New Jersey. <laughs> Two days from now, Raquel and Joel's journey continues. For their honeymoon, they are going on safari in South Africa and then continuing with other African travel. 
But their journey really, truly begins when they get home. Listen, you guys, this is for you. A journey of love and commitment, of shared values, goals and aspirations, of joy and the occasional bump in the road to be overcome, working and playing together as they travel with each other down life's path. And perhaps if things work out according to plan, they might at some point be joined on the road by a junior member or members <laughs> to share in the journey. <laughs> and maybe when they get to be my age or even a bit younger, they too will have the opportunity to share my experience today of all the pride and love I feel for them on their wedding day. So I would like you all to join me in a toast to Joel and Raquel as this new chapter in their lives begins. May this new journey which starts from this day forwards be filled with joy and happiness and all the love you could ever hope for. To Raquel and Joel. Thank you, Leonard. Very nice. Big round of applause. Yay. All the way to the bride.